Good morning, Washington Elementary Patriots, and welcome to WSIC. Washington School is Cool News Program. I'm Austin, your news anchor for today. T today is Tuesday, March 14th, 2017. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and Moment of Silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic in which it stands, one nation, under God, invisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our moment of silence. Tomorrow will be our second annual science fair. On Friday, we will have club day. On the menu for lunch today, you will have a choice between cheese sticks, grilled chicken salad, stream broccoli, glazed carrots, leafy green salad, and banana or craisins will also be served. Let's now check in with our other WSIC reporters and see what they have to share with us today. Good morning, I'm Yelissa Clown, your WSIC meteorologist for the week. Today will be 54 degrees, it will be partly cloudy. Tomorrow will be 60 degrees, it will be sunny. Our proud patriot for the day is Noah from Learning Center A. Looking great, Noah, thanks for your help. Report Reporting for WSIC, I'm Alyssa Colon. Tune in tomorrow for the day's forecast. Now back to the studio. Animals that animals that live in the mountain biome. These are some animals that live in the mountain biome. Cougar, mule deer, bighorn sheep, and black bears, and much, much more. Some animals are small, are small. Some are tiny as an ant, but they're all still, but they all still live on the mountain biomes. There are tons of different animals in the mountain biome, like black bears, bighorn sheep, cougars, and mule deer. There are tons more. These animals fight to live. They might even kill to get something. These animals can get wild and climb the way to victory. Imagine a black bear and a bighorn sheep fighting. Who do you think would win? What do these vicious animals eat in the mountains? For example, mountain lions. They eat coyotes, raccoons, rodents, elk, hogs, and even porcupines. There are tons of different animals that eat tons of different prey. Some animals eat grass instead of meat. Mule deer eat plants most of the time and sometimes meat. These animals eat tons of different foods. Let's use a mountain goat for the example. It's hard for them to find food up on those rocky mountains and keep safe and keep themselves safe and their young from falling off a cliff. It can be a scary risk. Risk. Some mama and daddy goats even risk their lives to save their young. This is an animal that has a lot of risks ahead of them. Do you ever imagine that you're an animal living atop a rocky mountain? Well, if you do, this is how you would survive. Let's use a mountain goat. Food is sometimes really scarce, so these cute but vicious goats have to walk all around a huge mountain to find some food. Sometimes it may take up too long and some goats may pass. If they see some other animals or even if they see some other animals or plants of their if they see some plants or even animals of their kind eating some food that they want to eat alone or with their young they will have to battle them to get there i'm michelle mims your science reporter for today now back to the studio thanks team Remember, if you have anything exciting happening in your learning center, please let WSIC know. 
send an email to our crew at WSIC at k12k.com. Knock, knock. Who's there? Luke. Luke who? Look through the keyhole and you'll see. Signing off for the WSIC crew, I'm Austin. Tune in for next time for your WSIC news. Have a great day.